So when will Shiba Inu reach its breaking point and break out of the current levels that it's trading at? And we're going to talk about Bone as well in this video. I'm going to give you some data that you need to be aware of as far as on-chain data and kind of what the signals and the trends are looking like. Are we still headed for some bearish waters or are there, you know, is there a bull turn uh, to turn bullish right around the corner? That's what we're going to talk about in this video. If you're new to me, consider hitting that subscribe button or if you're watching this on Twitter, definitely give me a follow. All right. So with that said... Here is what is going on. All right, so Bone and Shiba Inu, they need to basically retest and they need to break out of their current levels. And if you look at Bone right now, Bone is down about 5% as of the recording this video, trading at around 75 cents. And if you look at kind of the one month, uh, we've been consolidating here. Let me actually change that. Sorry about that. If you look at the one month, we've been consolidating right here uh, where my cursor, as you can see, We've been consolidating now for yeah, about uh, three weeks, give or take. So right in here, um, two or three weeks, right in here, we've been in this consolidation phase. So nice accumulation point. Um, again, not investing advice if you're looking to pick up some bone. Not a bad, not a bad place to buy it. Um, you know, maybe DCA in dollar cost average in if you're looking at it. And remember, bone is going to be the gas token for Shibarium when it launches, and you can guarantee that when Shibarium launches, this guy right here is going to go up. Okay. So let's take a look real quickly at Shiba Inu as well. Okay, you can see the overall market is up 0.18. Okay, kind of moving down here, uh, looking at SHIB. So SHIB is just is, is very similar. It's not really doing much of anything. It's down 1% um, on the seven day and really flat on the uh, 24 hour. And you kind of look at the one month scenario here. Looks very similar, doesn't it? Look, we've got a consolidation phase going on here. It's really been happening for about the since the 9th of May, that consolidation phase. Again, kind of looking at when can Bone and Shiba Inu kind of break out and retest scenarios. So if you if you, if you want to look at like basically the on-chain uh, data, right? So the blockchain analytics from into the block three on-chain signals are entirely bearish and those are net network growth holders making a profit and large transactions has dropped significantly those are all specifically associated with shiba inu now i will bring you back to kind of reality if you look at what's going on in the overall crypto market you've got a situation where bitcoin and ethereum are basically you know stuck themselves and nothing really going on so this is more of a macro Kind of a bigger picture problem issue with crypto in general not not that it's a doom and gloom scenario it's just the reality of where we're at kind of financially the overall financial picture of crypto right now oh by the way stocks kind of similar languishing uh not really doing anything uh down closing down friday about 100 plus points of the dow jones um and so kind of looking at those two paired it's not a it's not a Shiba Inu issue. This is an overall kind of macro crypto scenario that we see playing out. People are people are fearful. They're uncertain. They don't really know what's going on in the overall market, um, and so people are pulling back a little bit. And that's kind of where we're at right now. I will remind you that historically, summers for crypto, June July, are usually very slow. Uh, not a lot going on. So just FYI on that. So that's that's it. Um, have a good one. I'll see you.